by getting foam on my nose. Odell Bruin was founded in 1989 uh, by Doug Odell, who previously worked um, at Anchor Brewing in San Francisco in the 70s. Odell has been a brewery which has always been on the radar for pretty much everybody that we work with here. Um, they've been in bottle shops ever since I can remember when I first started drinking what you, we could call modern beer or craft beer. They bring a kind of different approach to beer to what you'd see typically on the west coast or the east coast. It's almost like a modern beer but it's also a traditional beer at the same time. Odell have done so much for the scene globally and in the UK. They're famous for their mountain IPA a balanced, rich malt backbone, forward hops, and low bitterness finish. It's a real pleasure to be brewing with Odell. Uh, personally, they played a massive part in my beer journey. Um, I remember drinking bottles of um, St. Lepulin and um, Odell IPA uh, years ago when I was, I was just starting to open my eyes to American craft beer, and they offer something completely different to the likes of Sierra Nevada or, or Goose Island. It's a real pleasure to work with Odell, brewing a beer with them here in Manchester using English hops. We brewed with Jester and Mystic, whole leaf hops, showcasing new wave British hops in an old school context. It gives us the opportunity to taste a, a really bright yet traditional IPA and it uses the Mystic and Jester hops really bring a sort of uh, an earthy, a dankness, resinous. With that you get some, some tropical notes in there, you get juicy kind of blackcurrant and, and, and hedgerow uh, berries. And at the same time it also has a lot of pine. It just captures a, what we would want a, from a Colorado IPA, but, it bring, but by using our own yeast and Odell's grist, it still has the Cloudwater trademark flavours this is a beer that brings together what we do um, with that classic uh, Colorado approach. It's, and it's a beer that I think it's important to bring to people in this country. You know, there's something fascinating about a beer that's been made to showcase malt alongside hops. And that's exactly what this beer does. After every sip, you want to go back for more. I think this beer gives us a real look back into the history books. I think it allows us to step back in time and get a sense of what classic American beer tasted like when craft beer was a young emerging scene. But what it also does is gives the English hops a chance to shine. The American varietals that we love brewing with at this point in time are incredibly punchy, bold, ripe, well-developed flavors. I don't think the hops that Odell were using back when they started brewing their classic beers, when they weren't classics, when they were new beers to the market, I don't think hops back then in America would have had the impact that they have now. It's great to bring a beer like this to the audience in the UK. It's, um, it's so representative of what Odell do, um, but those, those English hops might take some people by surprise. So I think tasting this beer not only gives us that foundation of experience that we've got from Odell's malt grist with a little bit of a modern twist with our house yeast, it's simultaneously an experience that's modern but deeply classic at the same time. Uh, we were really lucky to fly these over fresh uh, from Colorado last month for friends and family in beer where, where Odell were pouring. Um, the IPA is tasting absolutely banging right now and um, 90 shilling is a really good representation of what Odell do. It's still their best selling beer, it's a delicious amber. Um, I think it was the second beer they brewed back in 1989 so it's, it's a really good beer to get a grounding in what Odell are and what they do as is the IPA. So um, head on to our online shop to pick up these and try them alongside um, our collaboration which will give you a kind of a nice feel of um, what we've brought from Odell's beer to our own house style. From Mountains Rivers Flow is the first of what we hope will be many friends and family collaborations. Continuing the spirit of generosity that the festival is founded on, we run Friends and Family as a not-for-profit festival. Last year we donated £20,000 to charities in Manchester that support our most vulnerable residents. 
So continuing that spirit into the collaborations this year, every beer makes a donation to charity, which keeps an income stream active for charities that find it immensely difficult to work just with windfalls. You can get from Mountains Rivers Flow on our web shop today, and I'd highly recommend that you check it out next to some of Odell's classic beers, which were flown over last month for the festival. 90 Shilling is their best-selling beer still, um, which is an absolutely remarkable thing after all of these years. We've got their IPA alongside many of their more modern recipes. It's truly a wonderful experience to be able to try these beers as fresh as they are. We're currently halfway through canning of this beer. We'll be finished on Wednesday, but the beer's currently available in our web shop right now, alongside fresh Odell beers flown over last month. I think beer fans that want to get their heads around what classic beer tastes like, where the inspiration for a lot of modern British breweries came from. I think this is a beer that's well worth checking out to get a sense of what it took to build the scene that we're in today. Cheers. Oh, that's a banger.